Welcome to Comcast High School Sports On Demand, powered by MaxPreps.com. I'm Cynthia Nichols. Brianna Turner is starting her final season as a Lady Mav. She's already accomplished so much, but she still has some things she wants to check off her high school basketball list. I mean, I like for my team to win state. That's just a goal for all of us in general. I want to be a McDonald's player um, and just those kind of honors. Brianna is one of the most celebrated high school basketball players ever. She's had an amazing career that has taken her around the world. Among her honors, she's won gold medals as a member of the USA national team, winning gold in the FIBA under 19, under 18, and under 17. She is a two-time gold medal winner of the World 3-on-3 three -three Basketball Championships. Um, just being there in general, like, I mean, it's 12-person roster. I mean, you're 12, 12 girls from the United States representing the USA. So, I mean, that in itself is just like, how did I get here? So it's really cool. How does she accomplish so much on the court? Um, I think I'm just such a competitor. I just really like to win. It's been that way from her earliest days since she was a toddler. Well, it started very young. You know, we got the little tights basketball goal when, when she could walk and she'd always go around and dunk the ball and she'd want to shoot all the time. We had a, a goal outside, you know, we'd go outside and shoot. But when she was five years old, she went to play with the YMCA and I coached her team. Well, actually the first team that, that she was on, it was a big group team and they had some group coaches. But when she was about six or seven, I coached a couple of her teams and that was really fun. As Brianna grew taller and started towering over her classmates, she learned to embrace her height and her athleticism. I realized I was good at it, so I was like, hey, I might as well keep on doing this a little bit more. And then I kept improving and kept working, so stuck with it. You know, but Brianna was always very coordinated and athletic. I mean, even from a young age. Um, you know, I know it sounds cliche and everything, but I mean, she never went through that awkward stage. She could pick up on things really fast. She played other sports. She was a really great swimmer. She played softball, picked up on that very fast. Just from, from a young age, um, she just displayed just great coordination. And you know, she was always tall, always tall, but she was never awkward. And um, I always felt that, that she was a pretty good athlete. It helped that she grew up in a sports household. Both her parents played college ball. I played at the University of Houston. Um, I started in 88, graduated in 92. It was a great experience. Um, you know, I just think maybe sometimes when you play a sport, you, you try to pass it on to your child. And she was, you know, a lot more athletic than me. And it's just been really fun to watch her develop. Well, I, I played uh, at McLennan Community College in Waco for two years. And I left there and went to Lamar. And I think just from my uh, experience with basketball and really just not having the guidance. My father passed when I was young and just listened to a lot of wrong people as far as choosing a school, going to school for the wrong reasons. I think that helped me in, in guiding her to make informed decisions. By middle school, Brianna was very skilled and already a dominant player. And that led to her getting national recognition at that early age. Um, after the game, you know, her, her coach came up and said, hey, everybody's talking about Brianna. And we were like, why? They want to know what grade is she in? And, and that's when it all started, when she was like 12 years old and really the, the national attention. So we've been going through this for a long time, you know, since she was 12 years old. She started high school at Westbury Christian. During her freshman year, the team won the TAP state championship. Brianna transferred to Manville to finish out her high school years. What sets her apart? Brianna is a versatile player, very athletic, and one of the few post players with the ability to play all five positions on the floor, from point guard to center. Her stats prove it. Brianna has scored over 2,800 points, 480 blocks, and she's closing in on 1,400 rebounds. And she still has the rest of the season to add to her already impressive numbers. I tell her all the time that she has more skill now than I had when I graduated from college. That's how far the women's game has come. And it's that skill that has gotten Brianna offers from numerous colleges. In fact, she started taking college road trips back in middle school. But she says one place just felt right. 
me, I visit my parents. I mean, they let me visit a lot of schools. So I was lucky for that. So from eighth grade, I got to see different schools around me. You got to travel, plane rides away to see different schools. So but another day, it, just, it was just a whole different feel for me. I mean, I've been to other schools of visits, but that one, it was just like, I've never felt this before. And I don't know, just, just the environment. I don't know if it was a coach. I don't even know what it was, but I just knew something was different about it. And so then I kind of had a feeling that's where I wanted to go. I think she's been truly blessed uh, with all the opportunities that she's worked extremely hard to put herself in a position. And I think with all the sacrifices that she's made as far as a teenager missing out on, you know, she's a July birthday. She's never had a so-called birthday party during the summer because she's always playing basketball. So, you know, when I, when I think about that, it, I, I really feel proud as a dad to know that, you know, she's fulfilling her dream. And you know now she's put herself in, put herself in position to go anywhere she wanted to go to school, and uh, you know she chose Notre Dame. Sometimes I look at her and I flash back and I see that five year old, you know, and it's just it's amazing to me what's happened. You know, when you start this journey with your child, you you never know where it's going to end. We we had no idea, <laughs> you know, all of this was going to happen and the notoriety that she's gained, not just locally, but nationwide. And the USA experiences have been, you know, incredible for her, not just for basketball, but life experiences. And so I just see it and I try to soak it all in and take it in because I know, you know, once she gets to college, you know, you know, she's a young woman now and it's just exciting time. And I'm so, I'm just so very proud of her. I'm Cynthia Nickerson. Thanks for watching Comcast High School Sports On Demand, powered by MaxPreps.com.